The longest standing sheriff in the state of Montana, Tony Harbaugh, retired Tuesday after 42 years of serving Custer County. A reporter, Riley Nagel, joined Sheriff Harbaugh on his last day of duty and has his story. I hope that the people of Custer County agree that, that I'm leaving it better than I found it. It has been an emotional day here in Custer County, not only for those residents Harbaugh has protected for over 42 years now, but especially difficult for the man leaving behind a legacy. This is County 14's last call off shift. County 14, I personally want to say on behalf of all of us that you have served, loved, and protected this community as if it is one of your own family members. Born and raised in Garfield County, Tony Harbaugh says he never considered a profession in law enforcement before graduating college in Miles City and finding a job as a detention officer in 1978. Someone would have said to me, you know, you're going to have a career in law enforcement. I would have looked at them like they were out of their, uh, out of their minds. Quickly finding a passion for the work, Harbaugh took his first opportunity to become a deputy sheriff the following year, eventually working his way up to sheriff in 1985 and as they say, the rest is history. Oh, this one down here is one of my favorites. <laughs> now 42 years later, Harbaugh is ready for the next chapter of his life. It's been my identity pretty much my entire adult life. Uh, after 42 and a half years, uh, going away from law enforcement is, uh, is a little intimidating actually for me. It's, it's time. Uh, my wife and I are looking forward to to enjoying, enjoying some time now too. One of my mentors said to me years and years ago, it's better to retire a year too soon than 15 minutes too late. Following his final sentimental cruise through Mile City, Harbaugh was surprised with a visit from the sheriff of Fallon County, his son, Trenton Harbaugh. What's going on? <laughs> Congratulations. And, uh, I hope you look forward to the retirement. Who was inspired by his father to follow in his footsteps of enforcing the law. I'd also be lying if I didn't say that I was glad that he did choose it and, and I am so proud of him for everything that he represents. The long-standing hero of Custer County was sent off with encouraging words from a number of his colleagues, Governor-elect Greg Gianforte and Attorney General-elect Austin Knutson. He's earned every bit of his retirement. Uh, the only word that comes to mind uh, for me when I think of Tony is legend. You now get to look forward to a little R&R &R and, and I hope you enjoy every minute of it. Allergies are acting up. <clears throat> Though residents of Custer County may be losing their trusted sheriff, Harbaugh says he will never be a stranger and promises to always be a friend and family to his community. I would like to thank all my brothers and sisters in this noble profession. May you all continue to be safe, serve the public, protect them, protect each other and yourselves. Godspeed to all of you. County 14 clear. Reporting in Custer County, I'm Riley Nagel, Montana, right now.